basically, I do a lot of work in Pro Tools. I worked in Pro Tools for many years. A lot of my older instruments were also edited in Pro Tools before I switched over. I switched over a couple of years ago. So what I want to do, you see the positions of everything on the timeline, I want to carry that over and it be the same in Reaper. Uh, this was a session I did at the end of August at uh, Otterhead. We're back here at Otterhead and it's the start of uh, getting into DSP and analog modeling. So it's an, a set of Audix Pre's that I've measured and this is essentially just the measurements of that. I know that Pro Tools already stamps its audio with time code, so I'm thinking if I match the time code between Pro Tools and Reaper, that gets us off to a good start. We go to our memory locations, which is Command and 5 on the numerical keypad. You click up here and go to Export Markers as Text, Include Markers. I'm doing it in the format of minutes and seconds and text. I've tried all of them and I couldn't really get any difference. But if I'm doing this stupidly, please let me know if there's a better way of doing this because I would love to have a better way of doing this. I did try to include the EDLs, the edit decision list, but for whatever reason, Reaper doesn't seem to love reading EDLs. And every time I try and Google this, I either get like some weird videos, yeah, just not quite the right thing. It will export as a text document like this. It wouldn't work in Reaper, it wouldn't import that. So I'd have to convert it to a CSV file. So the way I did that was bringing it into numbers and then you need to copy over the name, this bit here, to markers listing. I've exported this as a CSV file. It will then give me all of these. Now there's a few extra ones that I'll delete off. That should be everything. 1K EQ in. So if I just drag this in, and then I'm gonna come up to, and go to move items to source preferred position. Yeah, let's go for the big gun, shall we? So this is all of the uh, high shelf. So I'm gonna drag all of these in. Yeah, so that works. Yeah, I, I was I was skeptical that this would work, so I, I actually separated everything out. Item processing. This is magnificent. So now I can move between sessions pretty easily. Oh, this is fantastic. <laughs> This is a sort of start of figuring out that workflow and moving between stuff. Pretty great. Anyway, bye.